In the realm of competitive encounters, Pachuca enjoys a marginal advantage over Santos, claiming victory 25 times to Santos 22, with an intriguing tapestry of 24 draws intertwining them. The echelons of Liga MX also bear witness to their closely contested rivalry, where Pachuca's 22 triumphs barely edge past Santos, amounting to just one more, while 22 draws stand as a testament to their evenly matched battles. Delving into history, these two juggernauts crossed swords during their sojourn in the Segunda División A, now christened as Ascenso MX. Across the 1985-86 and 1986-87 seasons, Pachuca emerged triumphant twice, Santos etched their name in the annals of victory once, and on one occasion, the clubs found themselves in an amicable draw. This storied narrative extends to a 1-1 to -1 standoff in the 2008-2009 Superliga and a rendezvous in the 2018 Apertura Copa MX tournament. Here, Pachuca clinched victory once, and the teams once again shared the spoils in a harmonious tie. A snippet from the past echoes loudly, echoing the camaraderie of competition. Emerging from the realms of international reprieve, Santos finds itself poised to ascend as high as the third rank as they brace themselves for a road bout against Pachuca, slated for tonight. Santos basks in the afterglow of consecutive triumphs, both within the sanctity of their home turf. However, their journey beyond their familiar borders this season reveals a balanced record of 1-1-1. Yet, the looming challenge of locking horns with a Pachuca side that has succumbed to defeat in their previous two outings, shipping seven goals in the process, adds an intriguing layer of uncertainty. Santos derives ample offensive impetus from Harold Preciado, whose five goals in seven appearances catapulted him to the zenith of the scoring charts as the week unfurled its pages. Not to be overshadowed, Juan Brunetta orchestrates a compelling symphony this season, composing three goals to his name while also playing the maestro for several other goals netted by the team. In stark contrast, Pachuca grapples with the specter of offensive anemia, tallying a meager three goals thus far in the season. This count excludes an own goal attributed to Nathaniel Ananias of Pumas. To offer perspective, within the expanse of seven matches, Pachuca's offensive exploits are encapsulated within the confines of three goals and an autogol. Remarkably, they amass six points from these modest returns and harbor the potential to ascend to the 12th spot in the league hierarchy with a triumphant performance. However, Santos' historical frailty on the road shrouds this impending encounter in an enigmatic cloak. Pachuca, the harbinger of quality, boasts the services of Guillermo Almada, a managerial luminary who once helmed the Santos ship for a resounding six seasons before embarking on his journey with Pachuca in 2022. The convergence of both teams in the arena, cognizant of the profound implications a victory could unleash, promises an enthralling spectacle that shall unfold under the ethereal gaze of a Monday night.